Louise Jenkins Merriweather, a novelist, essayist, journalist and social activist. She grew up in the decade of the Great Depression, a time that would deeply affect her young life and ultimately influence her as a writer. She attended public school 81 in Harlem and graduated from Central Commercial High School in downtown Manhattan. In the 1950s, she received a BA degree in English from New York University before meeting and marrying Angelo Merriweather, a Los Angeles teacher. Although this marriage and a later marriage to Earl Howe ended in divorce, Louise continues to use the Merriweather name. In 1965, she earned an MA degree in journalism from the University of California at Los Angeles. She was hired by Universal Studios in the 1950s to become the first black story analyst in Hollywood's history. Beginning in the early 1960s, she also wrote and published articles in the Los Angeles Sentinel on black Americans such as opera singer Grace Bumbry, attorney Audrey Boswell, and Los Angeles jurist Judge Vano Spencer. In 1967, she joined the Watts Writers Workshop, a group created in response to the Watts Riot of 1965 and worked as a staff member of that project. Her first book, Daddy Was a Number Runner, a fictional account of the economic devastation of Harlem in the Great Depression, appeared in 1970 as the first novel to emerge from the Watts Writers Workshop. It received favorable reviews from authors James Baldwin and Paul Marshall. Daddy Was a Number Runner is a fictional account of the historical and sociological devastation of the economic depression on Harlem residents. Meriwether followed with the publication of three historical biographies for children on Civil War hero Robert Smalls, 1971, pioneer heart surgeon, Dr. Daniel Hale Williams, 1972, and civil rights activist Rosa Parks, 1973. In addition to numerous short stories, Meriwether published novels, Fragments of the Ark, 1994, and Shadow Dancing, 2000. Louise Meriwether has taught creative writing at Sarah Lawrence College and the University of Houston. She is a member of the Harlem Writers Guild.